Hello guys, so in this video I'll show you how to insert or, or set up an SDI camera and also I will show you how to control a PTC optics uh, camera through the CamShot model. Let's start from the beginning. First of all, I'm going to stop the streaming. So all the cameras that we're going to use, they're not going to be anymore. So first step is go to the Blackmagic Media Express. And go to Log and Capture. And depending where you plug the SDI cable, you go to Device. And then you can check the input 1, 2, 3, or 4. For example, this camera, the wide shot on the corner is connected on the Deglin Duo number one, meaning input number one, and it have a resolution of 1080i60. If we check number two, this is the front camera, 1080i60. Number three, and number four. Perfect. So all all, uh, all the four cameras are connected and working perfect. Uh, I always suggest to use 1080i60 or 1080i 5994. Those are very good qualities and it's easy to set up on the software. They're easy to set up. So I already have my resolution of each camera and where the camera is connected. Then I go to Mixer Server global sources in this case those four cameras are ptc cameras robotics so to be able to control the robotics on the avra you have to set up them on the um, you have to set up those cameras on the first five positions of the monitor section meaning you have to use global source one two three four and five in this case, I'm using four cameras. So I will set up the first four boxes for my cameras. If I go to Global Life 1, I go to Properties. And in here, I'll select the device, the input device I'm using. In this case, I selected the number two because, well, this shot of the camera is on number two. Again, the resolution was um, 1080i60. So first step is select the input device. If you go to configure, we set up the exact uh, frame rate we had on the Media Express that it was 1080i60i. Then in here, we select the 1080. And in FPS, we select the half. Of whatever we had before so on the Media Express we had 1080 1080 60 so in this case I have to set up 1080 30 always the half of what it was before so if you have a different resolution like for example 1080i 5994 in this case instead of putting uh, 5994 you put 2997 So in our case, it's 1080i60, and in here is 30. Okay, so once I set up this, I won't do the rest because they're already uh, working and configured. Uh, so in this case, I just modified the first one. And use in doing this is the way to see our SDI cameras on the monitor section. Then I activate again the streaming could be preview or stream and as you can see now I have my image on screen we have to give some seconds so the software start you know recognizing everything I read everything <clears throat> actually here is the timer uh, there you go it's active again and there you go that's our first camera.